This is the Mark 423 boost pedal from Creation Audio Labs. It's a wide bandwidth, full frequency response boost pedal. Again, 0 to 24 dB, absolutely pure, clean boost. Let's take a listen. So first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to click this pedal in and out of line. There's no change in the sound. There's also no change in volume. Zero is true zero. Now what I'm going to do is just play a rhythm and bring it up through the full sweep, up to 24 dB, hitting this amp. Now that overdrive you hear isn't the pedal distorting. It's the preamp on the amplifier behind me. So if you put this into something, say, like a power amp or a bass amp with more headroom, there would be no distortion. It would be your instrument, just 0 to 24 dB more. Now another thing, with 24 dB hitting the front of this amp, if I just play light, don't even bring my volume down, it's clean. Play a little harder, it's overdriven. So there are no artifacts added by this pedal. No noise, 0 to 24 dB, pure, clean boost. The Mark 423 is exceptional, even on the bass, because it has a flat frequency response. Therefore, it's not tailored to just an electric guitar or to an acoustic guitar or whatever. It's going to give you 0 to 24 dB more of exactly what you put into it. So with that in mind, you can also take the Mark 423 with your bass and use it as a variable DI. Perfectly clean, perfectly clear, right into the board, no coloration. Now, besides sounding amazing, there's some really cool features on the Mark 423. First off, it's a stainless steel chassis, very durable, you're not going to destroy it. Inside, it's all pro audio components, no cheap stuff in here. It's going to sound amazing no matter what you put through it. It's also made right here in the USA. The jacks for both audio and for power are located on the top, so it's not taking up any additional real estate on your pedal board. You can sit it right down in the corner, it's only taking up the width of the pedal and you're not worried about stuff sticking out the side or having to space it with other pedals. Also on the bottom to help you with that are four screw holes. You can actually hard mount it right to the pedal board and you don't have to worry about Velcro or stuff coming off or getting sticky or making a mess. Now, the LEDs also let you know, first of all, if the pedal's engaged or not, on or off, as well as behind the laser cut logo, there's an LED just to let you know that power, in fact, is connected. 